Hello, today I will be telling you how you can solve the connectivity issue between your base machine and your virtual machines. So I will open my virtual machine. Okay, it's in drive D. So I will go to the virtual machine settings and will click on a network adopter. Okay, so once opened, you will have these type of network connections. The bridge concept states that if you are having a one base machine and the base machine is holding a virtual machine, so you can have the connectivity between both base machine and virtual machine as well as the other PCs, external PCs and laptops too because they are connected to the same access point and the virtual machine is getting the IP address from the same access point and whereas if you see the network address translation net it holds a concept that you will be having the connectivity between your host machine and host or base machine and virtual machine but you cannot ping or you cannot have a connectivity with the external machines so if you see the concept of host only the host only concept states that you will be having the connectivity between different virtual machines a base machine holds but the base machine cannot also ping the virtual machine as well as the virtual machines cannot also connect to the external machines in my case i will be using bridge connections so we are here to the login screen and we will log in here okay so once we will log in we will check the ip of our virtual machine and our base machine so we are here so now we will check the IP and we will type the IP config here first we will adjust the both screen in parallel in order to access and we will open the IP sorry CMD in our base machine So I will type IP config in my base machine also and virtual machine also. So my base machine IP is 11.3 and my virtual machine IP I will check IP config and it is 11.251. actually i have set my ip address static so i will do first it dynamically assigned we'll go to the network adopter settings adopter options and right click properties ipv4 and I will obtain IP address automatically and press OK so now I will check the IP address again by typing IP config command so that what IP address my virtual machine gets so it's 11.22 
so first after this we will check the connectivity between both our base machine ip is 11.3 so we will be putting 11.11.11.3 so there is a connectivity between virtual machine and base machine so we will check cross check with the base machine too we will type the 11.11.22 and there is no connectivity we cannot ping our virtual machine so just to solve this problem we need to check two things first our firewall it should be turned off and the user account settings so i will go to the control panel type control panel and we'll search for the firewall as you see it is switched on so i will turn it off press ok and we'll check the user control settings and we'll do to never notify okay now we will check first we will check from our virtual machine to base machine if it is giving a reply yeah there is a connectivity and from our base machine too it should give a reply so there is a reply and connectivity now so with this i will show you if we put the static ip address so in that case we might have a connectivity or no so let's put the static IP address in both PCs again we will go to network adapter settings adapter options right click properties IPv4 and we will put 11.11.11. and we will say 50 subnet mask will be 255.255.255.0 default gateway will be our router gateway to which our base machine is connected and if you need to use internet you need to type prefer dns your default gateway 11.1 okay we have set the ip address is static here now we will go to our base machine and properties ipv4 and we will give here 11.11.11 .11 .11 eleven dot fifty one sorry eleven dot eleven dot eleven dot fifty one and the subnet mask will be the same two five five two five five two five five zero and default gateway will be the same eleven dot eleven dot eleven dot one so the preferred dns i am typing 9.9.9.9 so if you want to use internet you should type your default gateway as it is in dns okay so now we will check the connectivity let's close this so we need to close this too okay and we a little higher okay so if you check now the ip 
it's 11 dot the static IP we set here it's 51 in our base machine so we will check the virtual machine IP too and it should be 50 11.50 so to check the connectivity we will ping 11.11.11.51 from here and there should be a reply so we will check it from the base machine to ping 11.11.11.50 And there should be the connectivity and it should ping yes there is a connectivity 11.11.11.50